Fair Practices Act states that a subcontractor is chosen, he cannot be replaced unless a legal reason is evident and only the, at the approval of the government agency or the public entity, okay? That means that if I, if Winslow hires me on the job as a subcontractor and on a public works, let's say you guys is working at EMWD doing that security thing, and I was a subcontractor that came and did some fencing and I did not show up. And you call Winslow, hey, Tyrone is not here, man. It's already been two days. You call again, it's already been three days. Winslow cannot easily just replace me. He has to get approval to replace me, even though I haven't showed up and met my obligation. There's a process in it. 